time to talk baseball with ESPN's Tim Kirchin. What can you tell us about Julio Franco's hands? Um, he's got he's got big hands, and you know when he used to hold that bat up in the air like that, he used the biggest bat I've ever seen. Every week during the baseball season, ESPN's premier baseball insider joins Dan and Stu Gatz to drop some hardball knowledge and take your calls. Dan, get this. He used to take BP with a batting donut on that huge bat. And he would hit a line drive after line drive to the opposite field with a batting donut on the bat. Here's Dan Levitard, Stu Gatz, and Tim Kirchin on the flagship home of Miami Marlins baseball. AM 790 and now FM 104.3. The ticket. He used the biggest bat I've ever seen. Tim Kirchin joins us each and every Friday at 4 o'clock. Takes your phone calls at 786-360-0790, pound 790 on the Metro PCS phone. And Tim getting set to join us right now on the Sports Grill guest line. Voted best wings in Miami. Find your location online at sportsgrillmiami.com. Neil Brennan is going to join us in 30 minutes. Very funny dude. Co-creator of the Chappelle Show. A lot of interesting things to talk to him about 4.30, Neil Brennan, Tim Kirchin. There are some open phone lines for him if you'd like to talk to him. 786-360-0790. I'm not sure if, if Kirchin even knows this. Uh, Tim, are you aware? Do you know why that Julio Franco is your intro, uh, the introduction to your segment? Do you even know why? Uh-huh. Well, no, and I'm afraid on this show to even ask why, Uh because you guys have some preposterously stupid answer for this. It's going to embarrass me, but yes, I've been intrigued by this. What does it mean? All right, so you've never asked. You've never asked, and that's because... I'm afraid to ask. Okay, well, here. Explain that, Well, since you asked, here is why. Mo, you're on 790. I don't know if you if you know that Julio Franco used to play in Mexico City before he was called up by the Braves. See, si. and so I'm from Mexico City, and I was I was producing the post game show of the Mexico City Tigers. He was crushing the league at the time. He had like five home runs that day. He was batting 580 something. So I sent this Latino girl to do the interview after the game because he had a huge game. And she got into the dressing room, and she came out. You know, the the Latino skin is kind of light brown, and she came out of the of the dressing room whiter than Hubie Brown. So I said, "What's wrong?" And she said, "No, no, no, no. Please, you need to make this interview. I can concentrate." So I went in with the, with, with, you know, with the microphone and everything. And Julio Franco was being interviewed naked. Man, it was the biggest monster that I've ever seen, okay? <laughs> so I, I, I concentrate, and I said, hey, Julio, ¿te molesta si te viste, compadre? Y me dice, well, that's the way I roll. If you want if you want the interview, you have to watch me. And I said, okay, I'll watch you. And man, since that, I'm not gay, and since that day, I, I, I don't feel sure about myself. <laughs> <laughs> Seven eight six three six zero zero seven nine zero is the telephone number. Poor Tim. Seven eight six three six zero. He's whiter than you, bro. <laughs> That's why he laughs. If you have any baseball (laughs) questions, (laughs) we're back with Tim Kirkson after this.